Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I have a really weird looking survival game for you guys to check out today. Um, this is free on Steam right now. They only have a demo. I will leave the link for that in the description. Um, but yes, this is Hell Corp. It seemed like a really interesting concept and a different theme for a type of survival game. The screenshots honestly look kind of like when we played Seven Days to Die, but the Darkness Falls mod. Like, kind of like demons and stuff like that. As you can see, this is only Alpha 0 0.14. So, it's probably, that's probably the lowest Alpha number I've ever played that had a workable demo, so I'm interested to see how this turns out. But I guess the overall premise is, you're in hell. I'm, you're like, I don't know if you're a Grim Reaper or your own demon, but you're given your own piece of hell, I guess, to manage and survive in. I'm not really sure 100% on how this is going to go, but I'm excited to find out. Um, warning, he is stepping on people, so I imagine it's going to get a little strange. It might be graphic as stuff like that, so if, like, stuff about hell bothers you or demons as an idea and the graphics of people being in hell bothers you, then this probably is not the game for you. I don't know if it's gonna be the game for me. Uh King of Hell, Lucifer himself, has been pitched because of inflow of sinners in nowadays sinful world. <laughs> that voice is Processing crazy. so many sinners was not easy. So he decided to offer idle devils Okay, their so you're given like your own little piece of hell. Processing empire of their own to maintain and grow so their so own much company a survival game as and earn higher ranks in darkness. This. Okay, this is cool. Okay, it's I guess it's not ready yet, but it looks like you're gonna be able to have pets. I dig that. Oh. Press alpha one key to select harvesting mode. Oh no! So I was kind of joking how and thinking about like what am I gonna do in this game? Go make a stone axe and collect stone and wood like a regular survival game because I'm in hell and apparently my own personal hell is having to grind resources in a survival game and get, yes, stone and trees and rocks and stuff. That's funny. Alright, so it looks like I can grab things with one, and I can hit things with two? Punch things. So I'm looking at my hotbar. There's a person. F to pick up. Pick up the person? Oh, you have four out of five skulls. So, theft and minor assault. Financial crimes and theft of property. And you have a four out of five? Seems like a lot. I don't know if you guys are gonna be digging the background noise. It's kind of a lot. All right, what is this? Two skulls kissing and creating sparks. Okay. Can I jump up here? Oh, you can't jump. Hey, there's another man over here. Alright, this is weird. I don't know what to do with these guys yet. I'm picking them up. This guy killed people and his potential's lower. I think I need to rework some some things. What? Oh, what's happening? Oh, that's very loud. Picked up a lava boiler. Picked up wood, metal. Oh, stuff. Okay. Oh. Place a machine. Okay. This. Oh, I put wood in there to make charcoal. But what do I need for, like... Ooh, build. Okay. Low XP for unlocking. Unlock at 45,000. Is this my XP in the right-hand corner? Or is this? This must be my XP in the left-hand corner, the lower number. <laughs> 700, wow. That's, that, that's probably way too high for a demo, because 
It seems like, yes, my own personal hell is going to be grinding resources. I don't know what I'm doing with these people. Why are crimes against women only one skull? What? Two times crimes against women. Killed many souls, theft and minor. Okay, see? I don't know what I'm doing with these people. I'm, I'm them, like putting them in my pocket, but they're not in my pocket. I don't know. Hang on. So, one other thing I've noticed. Why are these all men? This is... <laughs> this is the men's hell, apparently. Because these, first of all, have all been men. And apparently crimes against women are not... I need to rework things around here. It's a good thing I came along uh, and was put in charge. Because there's problems. Can I not get this tree? Oh, my cursor. The little white dot has to be exactly over it. That sounds like an alien ship landing, first of all. Excuse me, pet. We should name that. In the comments, name the pet. I can't actually name him, but you guys can, and we can call him that now. This is gonna be like a grind. Look, I can't even build anything... Look at that. The XP that I need. That's that's too much. Parts. We can make wood. I wonder if we can make a workbench. And craft things faster. The sin saw. I don't think that's a workbench. Right, should I pick up this guy? I don't know what I'm doing with them. Oh, here we go. Okay, thank you. We've changed the rules of hell now. Crimes against women are now ranked a little bit higher. That's good. But also, the man who murdered people, I think he only had three skulls. So it's these survival games. It's always a balancing act. I'm sure it's the same in hell. We are under new management. It's fine. All right, let's place some of this stuff down. They gave us a campfire that I can only make charcoal with, which I suppose in hell, I mean, I'm already skin and bones, no skin. I'm dead already. So I have a feeling I don't need food, which is an interesting concept in a survival themed game. Where shall we put this? I, g I guess here's fine. I kind of, oh, that's so loud. I want to put the, ooh, what happened? Why am I floating? Let me go back to walking. Thank you. So, I want to put stuff close to this. Punish the sinner. Oh, wait. Is another one coming? What happened? How'd I end up over here? How'd I end up over here? I just teleported a little bit. Did you guys see that? Was that supposed to happen? I was reading the thing, but then... Okay. That was weird. Okay, here's our pot. Let's see if we can make something now. Interact. Oh my god. Wow. There's a... There's a timer. Is there a radius to where I don't hear him? It's so loud. I'm a horrible person. Oh my god. Can I turn that like... I don't want to hear that. I'm turning it down. Oh my god. Wow. Is this a campfire then? I thought I would cook things. Like things that are not people. Do I even want to know now? Uh, I don't really want... The placement on this isn't very good. Because I want to put it like in front of me. I guess, I guess there's fine. It's kind of being annoying. Alright. <laughs> Do 
Wait a minute. So are all of All of these are like not tools. The head cutter probably could have given it away and a guillotine. These are not workbenches. What is that purple? What is going on? Ah! Spiders! Oh my gosh! Oh no! Maybe this is my hell. There's spiders. I don't... I don't... I don't like this. Is this how you fight them? Are they gone? Oh, I don't like the... I can't just hit, like, in the spot that I want to go to? That's wild. Oh. I can... Ah! I think that one's still alive. Die! Okay, so there are things to, like, fight. Where'd my pop go? Uh-oh. Oh no, my pot! My pot's gone! Not that I was particularly fond of that thing. It was very loud. <laughs> Crimes Against Women is now ranking higher. I feel like this game heard me. Where'd my pot go? Uh-oh. I think the spiders uh, may have hurt my pot. Barricade. Can I build a house? I need a lot of XP for this stuff. Wow. Oh, I can make a gate. Ooh, a turret. 100,000 XP and I have 3,000. Reward ready. What do you get? Metal. Oh, a lot of metal. Okay. I'll just add another. Oh, it's so wrong. I feel morally wrong playing this game. I mean, it's a hell corporation, so I don't look. I don't know what I thought I was getting into, but it definitely was not this. I was like, oh, it kind of looks like Darkness Falls, and it's got a demo, so you guys can, like, join me. All right. This just popped up. Um, I wish I could go back because it explained what the skulls were, and I guess they, they provide some source of energy that powers the machines, I guess. And you may have to build additional, like, pillars or more energy. Almost like a generator is what it sounded like. But now this also says that that circle in the sky, the upper layers of hell drop scrap resources they don't need. Which that explains the boxes coming out of the sky. Um, charcoal is also required for machines, apparently. I did not know that. I'm going to have to make some more. Um, this is part that I did understand already that you can craft... Sort of like a base. Um, as your level pro as as your level progress is, other devils who have their own business won't like your growth and start sending their minions to destroy your mach machines. Don't let that happen. That's what happened to my pot then. Oh, I didn't know, and I lost it already. Dang. Can I send minions into their hell? I would like to. Uh oh. Why am I at the wall? I teleport! Why do I teleport every- Okay, couple things. One, this is gonna take forever to grind. Because you can only craft four things at a time. So my advice to anyone playing is to constantly be going into your inventory and try to be mindful of crafting things all the time. Two, it does get repetitive all the time to just be at the circle and constantly collect those boxes. And that's gonna get- kind of boring after a while. No offense. I, it's an interesting concept. I haven't built all the machines yet, so let's see how it goes when, you know, more difficult minions, I guess, show up. Um, but definitely need a workbench so that I can mass craft these things, and I think definitely need to rework the XP because from what I'm doing, it's a long road to the 100k XP, and I'm not sure right now if I have to spend that. That's what it says it costs. So in other words... I have to spend the XP that I do get and then rebuild more up, up more XP again. And that's a lot. That's a huge grind. Not, not only for this, but for like a demo. <laughs> like I'm shocked. Like most of the gameplay is based around 
and the time is based around you having to grind this stuff. So I feel like, and it did say, this is such an early alpha that I'm surprised that this even works uh, as well as it has, honestly. Uh, and I know it said you guys were working on rebalancing things, so that's great. Uh, I do think that's probably the biggest thing right now. Okay, so it has now been an hour and a half since <laughs> I last talked to you guys. Couple observations, couple things I hope or wish would change is you don't automatically pick things up when you harvest them. You do have to hit F. It's so strange for me to hit F. I really wish it was E. I cannot reconfigure the controls because it's such an early alpha. That's like minor in comparison to my biggest complaint is that you have to collect so much XP in order to unlock everything. I can now unlock all the machines that are available. I didn't notice before that these are not available in the demo, so unfortunately I won't be able to show you guys these today, but I did just unlock and build enough to do these, so I'm going to go ahead and craft and unlock all of these things to see what they look like, and I waited uh, for you guys just in case something comes along and destroys it like this pot did. Um, and I realized that m a large majority of your XP comes from punishing these guys and putting them in these crazy machines and it does take a while but yeah um it like okay let me explain it this way so look at all the materials i have i have over 1500 wood i have more than enough i don't need to collect any more however to craft things now this is the fastest thing you can craft okay i have to turn everything into ingrams or ingots or what have you it takes 30 seconds to craft one i can craft four things at a time only and i'm also like still bored and harvesting things and trying to kill time in between all that so you're not constantly going back to your inventory right away unless you're really monitoring it so now you need sometimes up to 60 of these ingrams so do the math you spend, like, what is that, 10 minutes or so? Very rough estimate. Just crafting these wood ingrams. And then you also have to do everything else and still craft everything else. So not only does it take forever just to get the XP, it then takes, like, 20 minutes, I think, just to be able to craft everything. And no, I don't expect you to get everything all at once in a game like this. You gotta have some gameplay, but however, to me, it's very grindy too grindy uh and for example like i don't need any of these resources between them falling out of the sky i have all i need because it falls out of the sky and it takes me so long just to craft the individual materials that i don't really need to harvest things i'm just harvesting things to kill time uh and another thing is look i've cleared this whole area back here i was curious to see if it would respawn it does not which is not a problem yet or at all, I don't know, because things do fall out of the sky. It, it's not been an issue. Um, I don't think it would be an issue, but the fact that for now I can see the whole map, um, I think it would turn into a problem where I will very quickly... Oh, we leveled up. I would very quickly um, run out of things to do. Like, right now, I'm just... The only reason I harvest all that was to kill time. And, uh, yeah, I'm gonna run out of ways to kill time. I just kind of ended up standing here creating charcoal and keeping an eye on this uh, so that I could put another dude in for XP. Uh, all right, guys, I finally have my machines ready to place and see what they do. It feels like it's taken forever. Um, but we are gonna place them. Now, if I was playing this game, like, seriously, you wanted to continue it, um, I, I would think I would place the machines over here, actually, because I don't think that enemies can destroy these posts here, since this is basically your generator. Um, oh, did it say you can't build? Oh, up there, obviously. So I would put them kind of like here in the middle, and then they might get some natural defense, at least on one side. And you might not have to build so much and take so much, it just takes so much time to do anything that I feel like you're going to have to strategize in, in a way like that. I kind of, all right, I'm just, for now, I'm going to place these guys here because I want to be close to this so that I can put people in it and defend it myself. So we're going to build that. And we're going to build this. I do wish I could place these a little bit better. 
Look at that. The second I place it. Do you see this? Get away. Oh, God. There's a lot of them. Oh, man. All right, hurry up. I put a sinner in there. Oh, my goodness. All right. I knew this was going to happen, but I didn't think it was going to be this dramatic. I can't see them to actually defeat them, I feel like. It's very hard. Oh, we missed it. I missed it anyway. Still? Wow, the second I built this thing. Sucks. And it's really hard to, uh... Okay. Now that the swarm is gone, let's see what this machine does. Ah, his head's gone! Oh, he's part of, got part of his spinal cord, and then it just regenerates. That's crazy. Alright, let me put a guy in here. Let's see what this machine does. Oh, it's awful. It's so bad, you guys. I'm a horrible person. Okay. So, I'm glad I kind of put these ones in XHL. Let's place this one. See, I can't... there because a swarm is gonna come I guess every time yep there they are oh they destroyed my campfire one the spit wow I didn't even notice that all right what does this one do Ew. Just sawing him in. Look at this nonsense right here. I now have three of them. I see a spider up here. Alright, I'm curious to see how fast it's gonna be. Look at this thing. Okay, I got it. One thing is, I don't know how to repair these machines. I don't think you can repair them at the moment. I don't think you can repair them at the moment. Sorry, it's very distracting and weird. Um, God, it's so bad. So now we just have to sit here and like watch this in a really weird way. And I want to get to... We just want to build this. And as of right now, I need a lot of XP to do that. I want to test out some of the traps. Maybe this one too. This this one looks interesting. That's a hundred and seventy five thousand XP that we need to get. I don't know if it's worth it to you guys to see it, but I do want to see how the traps function at least. All right, so here's here's where I'm at. I put torches on each side of this so I can have it on all three sides. Um, it did seem like the spider came right up to it anyway and was hitting this side. Since then, my pets got stuck in there. So I don't know if they can now attack that side. But my idea was to put a turret on this side. So I finally just used 100,000 XP trying to do this. And then I realized this says darkness 500. Um, so I've unlocked it now. I thought that this in the top right hand corner was darkness. I know that this here is like making energy or something. I don't know if I gotta be over here to craft it. I'm a little confused about that, but I've gone through, I don't know how much now doing this. And I'm a little upset that right now I don't know what to do. I've collected everything. I like, I've gotten all this stuff. Never gotten darkness. I know it said this was like the generator and this is where you power things. So right now I'm here. I, I'm not understanding. 
Alright guys, so I've gone through everything, like I've tried everything that you can build here other than the torches uh, takes darkness. And now it's not that I didn't see that until now, I just saw that little symbol and in the beginning it talked about kind of like a generator or electricity and needing to build posts to have more. I thought that meant that this one here gives me X amount maybe the 485,000 as I've leveled up in the top right hand corner and that that would be able to allow me to build and I have everything needed except the darkness like I've tried to use the books I've tried to put them in my hand I've tried like all different things and I'm not sure how to collect darkness and I've now played for several hours I've leveled up quite a bit um, I've built or at some point I've had every machine that is available to me I didn't get you know anything out of torturing people nothing falls from here that is darkness I would think I would have encountered it by now so I'm a little afraid that it's not in the game yet which if it wasn't in the game yet you would think that they would put the little overlay like some of these machines not available in demo it's that's not there so I feel like I should be able to get it so I don't know what I'm missing um, I actually joined their discord and tried to message the developer unfortunately they are not online right now so I'm kind of trying to figure it out myself but I've not I've not been able to figure it out I'm I'm very confused and I also think that I would have seen other enemies by now I really think that too, like so far I've only seen the spiders and the screenshots show different enemies and so far I've only seen the one and I, especially after all this time of grinding, I would have liked to see more of whatever else uh, is in the game as far as enemies. I'm kind of afraid it's going to be like level locked and right now I'm at level 8 and uh, maybe you have to get to level 10 or something and like I said, it's just not worth it to me to try to even get to 10. Uh, there's nothing for me to do as far as, you know, grinding to get to 10. I just need to figure out this power thing. It's, maybe it's simpler than I'm figuring out. I just, I don't know. I've tried to craft under here. I've tried to put stuff up there. If you, if there is no solution, it either means that there isn't one and unfortunately it's not in the game yet or the developer hasn't gotten back to me. So comment down below. Let me know what you think about this i'm gonna cut the video off here and hopefully come back with an answer <laughs> so i still have no clue what's going on as far as darkness and using it i did confirm in the little screenshot from before that the top right hand corner number is my darkness level so i have plenty just don't know how to get it to use it to craft the thing however I don't know what happened, but I hit E, I go to crafting, I go to build this, and I've been like clicking around all over trying to figure out. I started clicking on this thing here, like darkness, wood, metal. See this middle thing, all these boxes going up? I don't know what I did, but I click on these and look, it spawns things now. So I broke something, but I wish I knew this earlier because each box is 10 XP. And I could totally have not spent the last two hours getting XP. I don't know. Does this happen for, like, everything? I'm just going to go through and click everything and see if all you get is XP. I don't, I don't know why this is happening. Here's the thing. It doesn't matter how much XP I could get now, even if this is, like, a glitch or something. I, like, hit every button. I've... I've hit like everything. I don't really know why this is doing this. I think it's funny, but it's not helping me really because if I can't get the darkness worked out, it's not going to matter. Like, yeah, it's giving me XP, but I've already built every machine I can. And the only things left to build require this darkness. So yeah, this would help me get a lot of XP. I, I don't know. I don't know what I did. But this is why I play these games early access. I'm pretty good at breaking them. 
This is kind of funny. Of course, it's ten at a time. So, you do the math. It would take forever just to spawn in and collect. But it's still, ironically, it's faster than doing the old-fashioned way. Which is pretty bad, in my opinion. Um, so, that's a thing. I don't know why that's a thing, but I can replicate it pretty consistently. You just click all the way up in here. I don't think it's... I don't know. You have to open the menu. You have to go to a crafting thing, and you just click. It's it's so strange. There it goes. There goes the tower. See it going up? I don't know. How weird is that? 